am back! Um, so I've actually been off with the flu, or I think it was the flu, I just couldn't stop sneezing and then I was ill and then it was just like, err, but um, yeah, I'm back! Um, so today's look is going to be a look from the Hunger Games Catching Fire when, which I went to see this Saturday just gone and it was so awesome if you haven't seen it yet and you're a hunger games fan get yourself off to the cinema and go and see it it is freaking awesome i mean like seriously <laughs> it's like i'm just sat in the cinema and it was so quiet you could hear a pin drop it was <laughs> but it's just so brilliant and um, the look i'm wearing is the look that katniss wears in the chariot scene and um, i'm gonna put a picture as the little thumbnail if I can find one um, but it's kind of like gold in black and it's got gold flakes but if you want to see how to do this then just please keep on watching okay so the first thing you want to do is apply an eye primer I've already done this and I use the Dakey Doll eyeshadow base and the reason I use this one is because I want the black on my eyelid to be really really vibrant so what I'm going to do now is just take my black eyeliner from Rimmel and I'm going to use this as a base along with the eyeshadow base and I'm also going to line my upper and lower lots of lines with this. So you just need to be really, just be random but try and make the um, edge neat if you get what I mean. I've also applied a bit of tape just so I get that sharp pointed angle. I just can take my finger and blend that out slightly. The picture I'm looking at, it looks like she's wearing kind of like a glittery eyeshadow, so I'm going to be taking this black eyeshadow here from the Dust Till Dawn palette from MUA and I'm just going to apply that over the black base that I've just applied. Now I have already applied my foundation. Um, it might be an idea to do this first, but don't do the gold bit, and then do your foundation. I'm just finding that out now, but um, I kind of did that eye before I did my foundation. Because um, you might get some fallout. I'm just going to bring the eyeshadow to a little point in the inner corner of the eye. And then I'm going to take my uh, blending brush and just blend the top edge out so it's not as harsh. Wait, we can all cheer because we can now get rid of the tape and you should be left with a nice sharp angle. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is just take a gold cream shadow and with this I'm going to go under my eye and then bring it out in like little feathered strokes like that so we're going to take it under the eye first and then do the feathered strokes the feathered ones you need to bring it up alongside the sharp line and then curve it towards the end of your eyebrow for the first one. And then for the second one you just want to do the same but a little bit further out. And for the next two you need to curve them down. that I don't know if you can see that because I don't know how well it's showing up on the camera but something similar to that okay so what we're going to do now is just go back to that black eyeshadow you want to dip your brush into it lightly and then tap off as much excess as you can and what we're going to do is we're really just going to line the outside of the gold and then under the eye as well we are going to be putting another color over the gold like another 
white gold eyeshadow just to set it but I'm going to do this first just in case I need to um, just go over the black just to make sure it doesn't stand out as much as the gold but um, you want to do this lightly I'm now going to be taking this gold eyeshadow here and I'm just going to go it over the gold just to make it stand out more. This also helps to set the cream colour. And then the final thing to do on the eyes is to curl the lashes. You can apply false lashes if you want to. I think Jennifer is actually wearing false lashes in this particular point, but I'm not going to. You can if you want to. and then apply some mascara to your top lashes only. Okay, so for cheeks, I'm gonna be taking this one because it doesn't look like um, Jennifer's actually wearing a very bright blush. This one is shade five from NUA. Just a nice peachy color. Apply that to my cheeks. the eye makeup is so heavy they actually kept her lip colour fairly neutral so I'm going to be taking the Rimmel Apocalypse in Nudie Cups. I'm just going to apply that. Okay so that was the tutorial and I don't know if anybody noticed but I'm wearing my Mockingjay badge which I got off our Amazon. If I can find it I will link it down below. Um, and I don't know if you can tell from my little owl thingy but it's only 21 days till Christmas. I still haven't finished my Christmas shopping, it's like terrible. Um, so videos I've got coming up, I've got a holiday makeup tutorial, I've got a tag that I made up. I don't know if any of the questions are the same or similar to um, all the Christmas tags that have been done but it was just kind of like I was ill, I just thought up some questions and kind of threw them into a tag so I'm actually going to be doing that next so if you see me wearing the same makeup that's why. Um, I've also got some other tutorials that I'm going to do and a couple of other videos so please stay in tune for that. If you're not following me on Facebook, Twitter or Instagram my links are down below. If you want to follow me you don't have to, I would appreciate it if you did. Um, during this last week I kind of reached a big milestone and finally got 500 subscribers. I want to thank you all so so much. It means the world to me that people are subscribing and liking my videos and um, I think it's brilliant, I really do and I love it when I see a comment, like I get an email saying someone's commented on a video as well um, so yeah, I hope you like this tutorial as much as I enjoyed filming it because I had really fun, good fun filming this tutorial I love Catching Fire, go and see it if you haven't already seen it I like highly recommend it, it was just so awesome I would go as far as to say as it's better than the first one but don't shoot me <laughs> if um, you don't agree but uh, yeah so that's today's tutorial I hope you like it, let me know what you think in the comments below please follow me on all my social media sites if you want to I hope you're all having a good day no matter where you are and I shall see you all soon, bye! Just close your eyes